All right, well, it's the weekend after Halloween, and you know what that means? That means daylight saving time is coming to an end. Our sun rises this morning at 745, but as we wake up on Sunday after turning our clocks back an hour, we'll, uh, our new sunrise will be at 646 a.m. Looking at our weekend forecast, mainly dry and sunny, trending overall a little cooler and closer to seasonable with highs in the 60s. And then again, that daylight saving time ends at 2 a.m. on Sunday. So you do get an extra hour of sleep this weekend. Looking at our dew point trend, we've been really dry and that might change the second half of next week but we did see some brush fires pop up the last couple of days so do know that we have moderate a moderate risk for some wildfire uh, danger just because dry conditions parch soil and make sure you are avoiding burning at all costs remember nearly 90 percent of wildfires are human caused it can be as simple as leaving a campfire unattended or discarding cigarettes out your window uh, so please be extra careful because we are in the middle of fall fire season all the way through the end of the month we're warming up next week and this is all ahead of a pretty strong front uh, that will arrive the second half of the week i will say we've been searching for some rain chances and it is a uh, definitely good news to see 20 to 30 percent chance here uh the second half of the week wednesday thursday into friday uh, maybe even wednesday night a little bit wetter across our region so that's something we're going to continue to monitor it looks like election day partly cloudy with highs in the 60s and low 70s